So tell, tell us what you, what you love best about the Fine Arts Center. The attitude. What attitude. do you mean? Well, the staff. Caring, like the, the whole staff. They want people to be immersed in the art. Like I said, with, with, with the membership, it's not you just go through it once. You come back, you see something that catches your fancy, you come back to see that, and you inevitably find something else. Is there a specific moment for either of you that you talk about as really having an emotional impact on you? Yeah, the uh, continuance of it. We can, we can come in better. We've seen it seven times. We went into the room with a 16-foot circle, and we sat down on the bench. It was just like that. It's, it, it, going into Vietnam at 17 years old, facing what we faced there, what a generation faced there, you can't share it. It's the, the old statement, if you weren't there, you wouldn't understand. That gave me a peace, inner peace, that I haven't been able to find you know, since I was there. And, and to be able to tell Colin that was even better. You know, it's like, you see the Sistine Chapel. You can't thank the artist in person. I did, I was able to. And it was a moment for him and me both. Art is not static. Art is ever-changing. Art is, 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 a, is a journey. Just the, of one piece, for instance, from the thought process to putting it up is a journey.